So I wanted to show you some real examples of some tire wear so you can be aware when you're looking at your own tires. This first example is um, too much air in the tire itself, so obviously it wears out in the middle. As you can see, the tread wear is sliding down to the wear bars on the side. So that's over inflation. You want to look at that with your own tires. Next up is this one, which this has to do with, um, this is an alignment issue because of the extreme amount that's shearing off the side here. Um, when you have something a little bit less like this one, this one's a rotation issue because most of the tire is okay and the other last half is, is the part that's going wrong. So that comes from a lack of rotation. This one, since most of it is coming all the way off, since this whole tire, almost half of it's gone, that's an alignment issue. Now over here I want to show you a little bit more of an even wear tire. See these wear bars? This is a pretty even wear tire. Um, pretty much this all comes down to if you ever have any weird wear, all tires do is show what's going on with your vehicle. And tires will wear even if you never rotate them because of turning. Next one up is feathering. This is actually from a trailer. This happens on sport utility vehicles and other stuff too. This comes from turning way, way, way too much and a lack of rotation. Um, next one here is also an alignment issue with this. See these diagonal cuts right there across the face of it? That comes from bad parts and bad alignment, so it's almost like it skips down the road. If you ever have a truck tire with like an angle of diagonal, it usually comes from shocks or from bad parts. As you can see here, this has the same exact thing. Um, this also has underinflation since the sides are bad and alignment issue. So this kind of gives you some an idea of different options of what to look for with tires.